Hey curl friends, it's Jazz and I'm back with a quick video for you. I'm going to be doing this voluminous perm rod set and I'm only going to be using 16 perm rods, so let's get into it. So I'm going to be using the Be Gentle, Be Kind new line from Briogeo. It has aloe and oat milk in all three of the items I'm going to be using. And I'm starting with the Ultra Soothing Shampoo. Now I really liked how this shampoo felt. It really was nice and moisturizing, did not strip my curls. I kind of felt like I could also detangle with this shampoo. But for me, when I'm using a shampoo, I kind of really just like to work it through my scalp, rinse it through the ends of my hair, and then go in with the conditioner to detangle. So I'll be using the Ultra Soothing Conditioner conditioner as well and this was really easy to get through my curls I was able to detangle with a breeze which is what you really want especially with me having a baby now like my wash day really just needs to be straight to the point so I was able to detangle really quickly which I like and I felt like I didn't really have to use that much as you can see it's nice and thick and moisturizing um, a little can go a long way and I did not have much shed hair which I was pretty happy with Next up is the Be Gentle, Be Kind Avocado and Kiwi Mega Moisture Superfluid Mask. Now, I love a good deep conditioner, especially because I'm a colored natural, but especially when they have things like avocado and kiwi. The avocado has great conditioning fatty acids. The kiwi is going to give you a great dose of vitamin C to protect your hair. It also contains spinach, which feeds your hair nutrient-rich antioxidants. So there's a lot of good stuff going on here. I already knew I was going to love this mask because I have the Avocado Co-Wash by Briogeo. So yes, this was a great match for that. I can't wait to use these two together. But look at this moisture. Now, I love when my hair looks like it has conditioner in it when it's wet. That's how I know I've gotten a good deep conditioning treatment. Now, I forgot to mention that I did leave this on for 30 minutes and I used my hot head conditioning cap. So if you're not deep conditioning with heat... I, I really don't know what you're doing. But yes, I deep condition with heat and these are my results and I'm ready for a great hair slay. So I know you've seen me do these perm rods a hundred times. So I've already did the entire portion of my head. I'm going to be using the Be Gentle, Be Kind Aloe and Oat Milk Ultra Soothing Detangling Spray. So I don't know if you guys remember using setting lotion back in the day, but when I used to get roller sets, the hairdresser would use setting lotion or my mom would use setting lotion. So this kind of reminds me of like a heavier setting lotion like it's not quite like a cream and it's not really watery spray but it's like a setting lotion if that makes sense so what i always do i always wrap use my wrapping method with my perm rods and the key to any perm rod set is this part here where you close it you have to close it across your roots otherwise you'll have a bunch of loose rollers and they won't stay in place and your set will be a mess so I'm going to show you again here one more time. I really like to do this wrapping method with my perm rods and my flexi rods. It kind of gives me the results you would get by using a rod set, especially because I'm using larger um, perm rods. And please make sure your hair is smooth. As you can see, I did stop and brush my hair again just to make sure it is smooth. That is the key to the perfect curl that you're looking for is to make sure that your hair is smooth. So like I said before, I did 16 perm rods. This was probably the least amount I've ever used, I think. But um, yes, I love that I used 16. It was really quick, large sections, really quick wash day. Um, like I said, with the products that I used, kind of helped with having a nice, easy wash day. I was able to detangle quickly. I deep conditioned for 30 minutes. And so like I said, deep conditioning for me is very important. I feel like it sets you up for maximum moisture for your style as you can see i only used one product which was more like a liquid water based and you see i'm left with these juicy shiny moisturized curls because i made sure i made those extra steps during my wash day to make sure my style comes out great I was actually pretty surprised that these curls came out the way they did with this definition, the shine and everything, and nice and bouncy curls. I was like, okay. So I really liked using less rollers because I feel like the more rollers you use, you don't necessarily always get more volume. But when you have bigger curls, it can give you more volume with less work. 
And another good thing I love about larger sections is so much easier to separate when you're going back through your hair. So I like to just tug on the curl, kind of loosen it up a little bit and separate it where it kind of separates naturally on its own instead of forcing the separation unnecessary frizz. And as you can see, I already have so much volume because there are larger curls, like I said before. So breezing through this this is basically where you make this style your own you can have as much or as little volume as you want but as you can see with this and i really did the bare minimum and i think later i realized that some curls i didn't even really separate fully so this is where you kind of get into your own thing make your style your own i did a side part you can do a middle part whatever works for you so I decided last minute that I wanted to do a giveaway for you guys just for showing me so much support on my channel and I appreciate you all so much. I'm going to be giving away the Mary Multi Masking Mask Trio Set by Briogeo. It was given to me and I have all three of these masks already and I kind of just want to pay it forward to someone who I know will love these masks just as much as I do. So all you have to do is follow me on Instagram, comment on this video, your Instagram page, and that's all you have to do and I will announce the winner when I drop my next video on Sunday and also speaking of videos this look that I did this makeup look I actually filmed it tried to do a tutorial and I think it came out pretty great so if you want to see that comment down below and let me know if you're interested in seeing a makeup tutorial but as always thank you so much for watching until next time bye bye